Tuesday, RSR family. As always, we are back here with amazing reaction videos suggested to us by you guys, our awesome RSR family. But for you new people here, we welcome y'all. We are so glad y'all decided to come hang out with us and listen to some amazing music. You are here Monday through Sunday, three times a day with you, boy Jay. Hey, y'all. You're also here with your girl Amber. And today we are checking out artists that Ooh, we have only done once. Now, wee. she has the most beautiful red hair. She also is a phenomenal piano player, and her voice is one of those that you could say is out of this world. Like the absolute killer combo of her piano skills and her voice. Guys, we're checking out some Tori Amos today. Last time we listened to her, it was the song Crucified. It's really good. And that's kind of, like I said, the one that kind of put me on notice. Her piano playing skills mm -hmm. matched right along with her voice. I asked you guys to drop some more songs down in the comments. Y'all did just that, so we're excited to get into it. But before we get started, there's a couple things we ask y'all to do. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on your post notification bell so we never miss out and listen to good tunes together. Today we're checking out the song Cornflake Girl by Tori Amos. Now, that's a title. Cool so I'm ready girl. to see what it could be about. We're ready to get to it. Y'all send suggestions. We give the people what they want. Let's check it out. That part's cool too, where we just paused. Incredible. All the different inflections and the way that she's singing. Like at one part, like it gets to, the music slows down and it gets to a really cool beat and she changes it up and then she goes into that high inflection of an airy voice. It's very high has. and airy, yeah. And then like like I said earlier, you get some some pretty rocking sounds, but the the piano is still that predominant yeah, thing sure. up front. I like Tori Amos. Me, me too, because like she has like a almost like a growl and angst in some parts of the way she uses her voice, and then I love that it's totally opposite from the voice that you described, where it is very high and um, very airy. Like it's very different to go from growl that little bit of you know when she expresses it the yeah. way you just kind of hear it just come and out. It's like she adds a little bit of spunk to, I know, to, like, yeah. to that one part. So from there to that like really beautiful airy, it's a fun fun song but i also like when she switches up her cadence right mm. and like like the way she delivers it this is not real or i think maybe that's the lines but the way that she delivers it right there it's really cool i'm digging it let's get back it's a peel out the watch with just peel out the watch with Oh, 
piano at the end. Absolutely incredible. Absolutely incredible. From now on, when we mention great piano players, Tori Amos is going to be in that conversation. So, I mean, from the very, very beginning, when the song started to the very end, that piano was amazing. And it was like... And they had a lot of different key parts, too. It had a too. lot of different key parts, and the whole time, like, there was never really a pause. Like, started playing, played through the whole entire song. But the way that it would come in and kind of come out and it would mm-hmm. change sounds depending on the inflections in her voice. And then, like you said, right there at the end, how it just kind of all amped up. It's cool. Hats off to Tori Amos. I'm, yeah. I'm, now, I'm now a big fan. For sure. I loved the piano playing throughout the whole thing, especially when we dropped everything and we had just like those single striking kings for keys for a minute. That was pretty. But at the end, it felt like it started off like with this really thick, heavy jazz feel. And then it just ramped up and it had so much more emotion. It just built. Feel like it had motion to and build anger and in it. Build. Yes. And my goodness. And in the video, like that kind of like toxic female friendship. Yeah. But at the end, when she was sitting on the. I, that looked like a merry-go-round to me. Yeah. Was that an old-school merry-go-round? Yeah, old-school merry really merry-go-round. really dangerous. <laughs> that was bad. But when she was sitting on it, the way that she was just, like, passionately moving and, you know, show, like, moving her body like a Kate Bush would when she gets into music. Yeah. I thought that I thought that that was, like, a really great part to watch as well. The whole, the whole, all, the overall, I can't talk today. Goodness. This has been two days in a row. This is two days in a row, y'all. I don't know why I can't he talk He hasn't anymore. been sleeping good. Maybe I that's got to be yeah, your sleep. I have not been sleeping good, but the <laughs> whole entire piece was absolutely amazing. So thank you guys for that suggestion. As we always send you guys out of here, we love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember every single day that you wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members, to hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome y'all to the RSR family, but you have a goal just like we do. Let them know. All right, guys. All you got to do is make somebody smile. We love you guys. Till next time, we'll see y'all later.